Hi there, I'm on an interesting little job today. I thought I'd just share with you what's going on in this apartment today. So let me turn the camera around and you can take a peek here. So this is an empty apartment. Uh, the resident has moved out and um, there was an odor issue. Uh, the people who manage this complex replaced the flooring, as you can see, with LVP. Um, they also uh, killed and painted the walls uh, and did a few other things like uh, cleaning out the cupboards and so forth. But there's still an odor in this apartment and they can't rent it out. So uh, what we're doing here today to help remedy the situation, it's just being described as a general body odor. It's kind of a, a very light, faint odor, but people can notice it and they, they don't want this apartment. Uh, it's still being repaired as you can see. Um, but what we brought, brought here to this uh, unit is a machine called a hydroxyl generator. And what that does is it kind of uses UV light to simulate what happens in nature with sunlight. So I'll describe that in just a moment. I'll turn the machine on. You can kind of see it running. Sorry for my shaky hand. I don't have my, a gimbal with me today. So uh, that's the machine when it's running. And you can see the lights in there doing their thing. Also, I'm just gonna turn it off again so you can hear me better. You notice this little bucket next to uh, the generator. This is simply a uh, bucket full of water with a little bit of a wick in it to help pull the water to the surface. And a little bit of humidity can go through the machine and actually makes it work more efficiently. We can use the machine without the water uh, added, but it just kind of works at optimal uh, humidity level of say 50 to 60%. Sorry again for the shaking of my hands. I'm an old man, gotta put up with it. But a tip when you're trying to deodorize a space like this with a machine like this is things like uh, closets, you wanna make sure they're open. And you might have noticed uh, earlier when I showed the kitchen area that I opened up all the cabinets to make sure that everything can get treated with the uh, hydroxyls. There are other things that we could use in an apartment to combat the odor, including using an ozone generator or chlorine dioxide gas. Those can be used in empty, unoccupied spaces like this unit. However, since this empty apartment is next door to other occupied spaces, I just think the hydroxyl generator is a much safer option. It can operate in occupied spaces. So workers can come and go while this is running, fix the corner bead in that drywall that we pointed out, and it's totally safe for them. So if you have any odor related issues at your property, feel free to reach out to us at rochestercarpetcare.com. Thank you. Have a great day.